Hello? Roll with it. She's electric. I'd already written um, towards the end of the last album. Some might say it came out as a single, obviously, like about six months before the album. Uh, the rest was just, you know, sat around just writing, just like, really just like farting about. Wonderwall took 10 minutes, literally. Cast No Shadow took like 10 minutes. Morning Glory took about 20 minutes. It just, uh, I mean, when when I was writing the songs for that album, they were, they were just coming so fast like that. We knew it was just going to be like the biggest selling album of this decade and the, and the best album of this decade. Because they were, I don't know where they came from. And to this day, it still startles me. They just, they were just coming out, man. And I was writing like a song, you know, I was writing two songs a day, man. That album took 15 days to record. So when we go in there, we're not fighting about. It's like we were doing a track a day as a live group. Roll of it was one take, A Love was one take, Morning Glory was one take, Champagne Supernova took two days. We was like, because we'll have been in the studio for, for two weeks, playing them through as a group. And when we go in there, there ain't no messing about going there for six months. It's like, we're a band. We play guitars through double loud amps. It doesn't, it doesn't take producing. Some songs do, like Champagne Supernova, took a bit of thinking. You know. The album was done very quickly, but you have to understand that being in the studio with Bonehead is not easy. Basically, it's like you're lucky to get him out of the pub. Actually, getting our kid and Bonehead and Griggs actually out of the pub, that is like your, uh, your challenge. But because we do so much on the. before we actually get in there, once we know what we're doing, we're doing it, you know. When I write a song, it's exciting for me because I'm sat in in my flat with like just a guitar and I'm, I'm writing it. And then you go into a rehearsal room. So you've got Bonehead with a big, dirty, great big master stack. And then me. And then you've got our kids singing it. And then the, there's a drum kit behind it. The song will just sound completely different. It'll still be the same song. I mean, you write a song out of like, comes out of nowhere like that. And then you take it to the group and then the group almost rewrite it. 